This video is a guide for USDA Federal Purchase Program recipients on proper temperature assessment when receiving deliveries of shell eggs. The USDA's Agricultural Marketing Service, Food Safety Inspection Service, along with the Food and Drug Administration, are the federal regulators overseeing the refrigeration of shell eggs intended for human consumption. FDA regulations state that shell eggs must be stored and transported under refrigeration at an ambient air temperature of 45 degrees Fahrenheit or less. Ambient air temperature is the temperature of the air surrounding the eggs during transport and storage. Unlike other commodities, the internal temperature of the shell egg is not regulated. A freshly processed egg may still be at or near body temperature when placed onto the truck and may take several days to cool down depending on the packing materials used. The following is a demonstration of proper assessment of ambient air temperature upon receipt of a delivery of shell eggs. First, verify that the seal is intact and matches the number listed on the USDA grading certificate. If the seal is broken, missing, or does not match the certificate, contact the Commodity Procurement Contracting Officer listed on the purchase order. Before opening the container, it's a good idea to check the setting on the refrigeration unit, or reefer, to verify that the setting is in a reasonable range. Note that there is no requirement for the specific setting of the unit. The seal may now be broken, but do not open the doors until prepared to take the temperature reading. Opening the doors allows most or all of the cold air to escape and will not allow an accurate reading to be taken. Using a calibrated stem type thermometer or a thermometer specifically designed to measure air or gas temperature, open the door just wide enough to place the thermometer on the floor of the transportation unit and immediately close the door. Alternately, smaller vent doors may also be used to assess temperature when present provided the door can be fully closed with the thermometer inserted. Allow the thermometer to sit at least 10 minutes for an accurate reading. Once 10 minutes has elapsed, quickly open the door just wide enough to retrieve the thermometer, close the door fully, and immediately read the temperature. If the reading is at or below 45 degrees, the process is complete and unloading may begin. If there is a problem with the temperature reading, contact the Commodity Procurement Contracting Officer for guidance prior to rejecting the shipment. Keep the doors closed. Do not unload any cases. Do not attempt to take the temperature of individual eggs or packaging and follow guidance from the contracting officer. Improper methods of temperature assessment. Infrared or IR thermometers are not an acceptable method of assessing ambient air temperatures. These tools are for measuring surface temperatures and will not provide an accurate assessment of storage conditions. As stated previously, the internal temperature of the egg is not required by regulation to be at or below 45 degrees at the time of delivery. Individual egg temperatures should not be measured nor should the probe thermometer be placed inside of a case for ambient temperature assessment. Once the doors to the trailer have been opened, cold air rapidly escapes. If the doors have been opened for more than 10 to 15 seconds, or if the doors have been opened widely enough for a person to enter, an accurate temperature reading is no longer possible. The doors should be fully closed and the trailer allowed to cool down again prior to attempting an assessment. Here is an example of a purchase order where your contracting officer's information should be listed. We hope that this instruction has provided helpful information for proper assessment of ambient air temperature and receipt of USDA donated shell eggs.